When Going Great sent me to check out the first Canadian International Teddy Bear Convention, I thought I was in for a lot of craziness. But then I met 13-year-old Graham Abbey and his 53 bears and discovered there's a serious side to collecting teddy bears. First of all, what's an Arctophilist? Uh, an Arctophilist is a collector of bears. And that's what you are? Exactly. Okay, how did you get started into collecting bears? Well, I, when I was little, I got one for Christmas, like one every Christmas, one every birthday, and they just kind of gathered over the years, and I just made it into a collection. Graham, which is your first bear? My very first bear yeah. would be right here. Oh, he's got... Winnie the Pooh. He's attacked. I used to take him on picnics when I was little. Yeah. Have Winnie the Pooh picnics, but that was my very first bear. Why are all the bears' first name Teddy? I mean, every bear you look at is called Teddy. Why? Well, President Roosevelt, Teddy Roosevelt, Ted Roosevelt, um, <laughs> was out on a hunting trip, and they hadn't found any big bears that they so they pulled out this little cub, told him to shoot it, and he refused to shoot it because it was so cute. Oh. <laughs> so um. After that, they started making cartoons and writing about the teddy bear, because Ted Roosevelt, the teddy bear. What better place to sell teddy bears than at a gathering of fanatics? Everyone welcomes the chance to look for a new addition to the collection and maybe learn about the latest bears on the market. So he only eats chocolate chip cookies. Oh, well, that's yeah. his name. Yes. Oh, I didn't know that. <laughs> oh, I thought it was this sorry. elegant bear. Abner <laughs> no, Smoothie. Abner Smoothie, yeah. yeah. What college did he go to? Paws Preparatory School College. <laughs> Here he is wearing his t-shirt. Oh, there we go. Paws Prep. Oh, rah, rah. And his eyes are closer oh, together than normal, and that there again was a sign of his elegance. Do you want to keep on collecting bears now that you're getting older? Definitely. Yeah? Because when I get a lot, they could maybe become a... a like a collector's collection. Right. You could be <laughs> the only kid money. on your block who went through college collecting bears. Yeah, right. right. <laughs> what do your friends think about you collecting bears? <laughs> they don't mind because it's collecting. It's not as if I play with them and they know I'm not the kind of kid who would really play with them. It's just a lot of people collect bears and it's just a hobby, mm -hmm. I guess. Um, you've got different kinds of bears. Uh, what are they? This is the Belosky bear that's mm -hmm. made in Germany. Uh, this is the Stife, which is made in England, mm -hmm. and it, this one's a growler, this is the <laughs> official Stife. They always have the bump on the back, mm -hmm. the, the original Stife bear. And this is a gun, because they're really soft. Hobo? Which one's Hobo? No, that's Theodore. Hobo, where is Hobo? Oh, we have Patty's holding Hobo. There's Hobo over there. And no convention of bear fans would be complete without a teddy bear's picnic. After watching others share a bite with a friend, I decided to find a lunch partner of my own. Bear Jay, I've been looking all over for you. We gotta go down to the Bears Only Cafe and talk bearsness. Listen, you know that Bears Necessity Contest? We've got problems, so listen, we'll go down, we'll talk business, and hey, everything will be okay. I love this guy. How do you choose your bears? Well. When you go into a store, you can kind of tell by the look on their face that <laughs> they're your bear, exactly. There's some guys who are, look sad, and sometimes they look mean, like they don't want you. But, what um, about that bear on your hand? What does he look? Well, I got him in Aspen, Colorado, and he, he looked lonely. Oh, look at this bear. He's so soft and cute. Uh, oh, let's see, let's see. He's cute. Oh, she's so cute. Look at that. <laughs> oh, back down! You're not a bear! <laughs> Well, as Graham Abbey says, if the bear fits, wear it. <laughs> <laughs>